Hey, what you got? Thank you, officer. Mm -hmm. We haven't touched anything. Been waiting on y'all. Two bodies inside. Kicked in door. Give or take. Man, size 11. A man was shooting after a woman. Where's the woman? ER. She was shot in the shoulder. And the guy? We surrounded him, told him to drop his weapon. He shot himself. We immediately identified him. Gambit Nelly, drifter. In and out of prison, mostly aggravated assault. Uh, one more thing. Whenever I was checking around inside the house, uh, well, I went and looked in some of the rooms. Something ain't right in there. It's just not the best way I'd want to start your day. Right. Looking forward to it. Is it coming? Anything? Nothing yet. You? Army Prince. Need a toxicology report as soon as possible. Sure, I'll run that by the lab for you. No signs of a struggle, attempted retaliation. Nails are intact, not broken. Just a single shot to the head. Now I appear that projected high velocity blood splatter was transferred when she was shot in a seated position. Or when she shot herself, I mean, that would explain the nine millimeter handgun. Dr. Gates, uh, I'm Detective Salinas and this is Detective Farrell. Good morning, detectives. I've heard a lot of great things about you. I'm reading your latest book, The Psychosis of the Criminal Mind. Um, any first impressions? I think the uh, two victims like to roll in their own filth. Well, the doors were kicked in. But maybe they were already dead. Both victims already dead in their own house? Something here's not right. Well, maybe he accidentally overdosed and she took her own life, like Shakespeare said. A noble mind cannot be without love. It's not wrong, young Juliet. This drawer open. I bet somebody kept all their little goodies right in here. Damn, this thing really is self shot. I've seen this before in a book. Some pretty sadistic impairment. Fifteen were lowered down with ropes. That's from the 15th century. Why are we creating now? Almost got it. Let's see what's behind door number one. 